The Middle East region is home to some of the most famous skyscrapers in the world, including the Burj Khalifa in Dubai, which is 828 meters high. In addition, Saudi Arabia plans to build a 2-kilometer tall skyscraper in Riyadh. That would become the tallest building in the world upon its expected completion in 2030. These towering structures are not only architectural masterpieces but also serve as symbols of the region's ambition and progress, showcasing the impressive technological and engineering capabilities of the Middle East. Kuwait joins the race to build the world's tallest building. After Kuwait's Municipal Council on Wednesday approved drawing sketches of Matanat al Harir, Kuwait has announced plans to build the world's tallest tower, called the Burj Mubarak al Kabir. The skyscraper is expected to cost 25 billion Kuwaiti dinars and will stand 1,001 meters high. The one-kilometer tall tower will be part of a larger development project called Madinat al Harir, the Silk City, which will be located in the Sabia district of Kuwait City. The project will cover an area of 250 square kilometers and is expected to include residential, commercial and recreational facilities, as well as a huge central park. This massive structure will consist of 234 floors, with a capacity to house 7,000 individuals. The completion project is expected to take around 25 years. The design of the tower is said to have been inspired by a traditional Islamic minaret with a slender top. The new landmark will house a range of facilities, including a hotel, offices, apartments and observation decks, as well as a range of retail and restaurants. It is expected to become a major tourist attraction, embodying Kuwait's ambition and progress. In addition, Mubarak Al-Kabir Tower and the Silk City Project are part of Kuwait's broader efforts to diversify its economy and reduce its dependence on oil exports. The project is expected to provide 43,000 jobs, in addition to attracting huge foreign investments to the country. Globalization has supported the exportation of exotic design and construction of many buildings including skyscrapers. In the past two decades skyscrapers have proliferated across cities all over the world, particularly those in the Arabian Peninsula, because of their massive bulk and soaring height. These skyscrapers have dramatically altered the urban landscape and city identity. This paper examines the role of skyscrapers in supporting place identity in the Arabian Peninsula. While the imported iconic skyscrapers with their flamboyant forms have been transformative in re-imaging cities and their skylines, in your opinion, can Kuwait snatch the title from the UAE by owning the tallest tower in the world? Will there be other countries competing with Kuwait for this title? Share your opinion with us in the comments. Don't forget to share the video and press like, so that you get everything new.